Well, from Thursday, commuters in Sangre Grande can expect to see traffic wardens on the roadways. Minister of Works and Transport Rohan Sinanan gave the commitment at a sud tuning ceremony for the start of construction of a licensing office in Guayco, Sangre Grande. He said since 2009, Sangre Grande was one of the towns earmarked for traffic wardens, but this never materialized. We came to Sangre Grande, we saw the building, we moved the traffic warden in, and Today, tomorrow morning, we will have 25 traffic wardens based in Sandy Grande. Again, at no cost, no cost to the taxpayers. And we were waiting for the last eight years for a building to rent. Minister Sinanan also revealed government's plans to bring licensing services closer to rural communities. Very soon, a mobile bus unit will be launched where everything except a driving test and vehicle inspection will be available office will be coming to you so if people in any of the rural areas these this bus will earmark one day to go to different areas and we are going to put something in place that you don't have to wait for your license uh, permit to expire if you know the bus is coming on a certain date and your license is going to expire in a month or two you can go to the bus on that day and get everything done 